Yo, what's going on with you YouTube? Jumping Chris here. We're coming back at ya with another vid. That didn't come out right. We're here for another early unboxing and we got a little uh, a package here from my guy 89 Figs, man. So definitely wanna just go ahead and show him love. If you guys didn't see, one time I had the, the red flannel. I'm gonna pull that out because I believe these are supposed to be some pants. So, pants. Oh, and I got a tea? What? He blessed me. My goodness. All right. Let's just let's just check out the tea real quick. Check out the tea. Now this is fire. Okay. I see it. Get it how you oh, get it how you live. You ready? You already know what time it is. And then it got the flames on the side here. This is actually a pretty cool design. Here, these are some cargos. Cargos with the eight and nine printing on the side. Let me see, see how these things fit. This is how the fit looks with the long sleeve. The long sleeve actually feels pretty good. It has that whole vintage like fade to it. And the pants is actually, the cargo pants, it's pretty freaking fire. These, it feels good, it looks good. I like the pockets, it's lightweight, you know, it ain't like heavy or anything like that. So, man, I appreciate, I appreciate it. 8-9, this is the one that I got the flannel with, with the design. This is probably gonna be like, Oh man, this is, might be my fit for when I go to SneakerCon. Oh yeah, this is fire. This is nice. So thank you so much, 8-9. Like I said, shouts to 8-9. I'm gonna rock this whole fit during the whole uh, video. Anyways, now we got an early unboxing. Kinda early, these are supposed to be coming out sometime this week, but I wanna get this early look and early review for you guys so you guys can decide if you guys gonna want these things or not. I've been saying about Air Jordan ones lately, this really hasn't been it. So hopefully these, th these kind of changed my mind of like how some of the Air Jordan ones been doing. Uh, like I said, Air Jordan one just hasn't been it. Some of the colorways, it just, it just okay to me. I know a lot of people is gonna hate what I say, but look, I guess keep it real with y'all. Like some of the colorways, it just, they just okay. You know, it's just, they just whatevs. It's one of those things where it's a little disappointing or they drop the ball. Like, you know, like the electric orange, the fusion reds, the core purples this year. Uh, the yellow pollens, I still like them. They're cool, but you know, at, at the same time, they're just like. Some people was hating on me about that because I said, oh, I really like. I, I don't think I've ever said in the video that I was hyping up the yellow pollens. I don't know. You guys must not watch my video, my videos like completely all the way through. Like I might title something. But you know, when I sit, what I say in the video, that's what I really mean. And sometimes, like you guys gotta watch it before you guys say something crazy. How it is, it, you know, some things it gets a little insensitive if I say the wrong thing. But I'm just letting you guys know. Most of the time, I, I just tell you guys how I really feel. I gotta keep it 100 with y'all. I really do. So, and you know what, man? Thank you so much. This is what good service is. All bubble wrap and everything. So. Like I said, shout out to my guy, Soul Chaser. We actually met in person at, uh, I think it was Charlotte or something at the sneaker exit event down in Charlotte. So it was a good time. So appreciate you, bro. Anyways, standard Air Jordan 1 box. These are set to release this week. So you guys probably know what it is. Let's just take a look at these things, man. Here it is. First time I'm setting my eyes on these things. Actually, no, I lied. I think I seen them once, but I really never paid attention. So. Here it is, gonna get my full impression in voila. Oh, here it is. Shout out to my guy, Soul Chaser. Is that what I say? Yeah, so Soul Chaser. Make sure you guys follow him on his IG, his, his website, and all that good stuff. He got some heat, man. So, anyways, back to the shoe. Wa freaking law. Now, it's had this. Is it Borax or Bordeaux? Bordeaux. Okay, nice. Bordeaux. These are the Bordeaux. It has that burgundy look to it. You guys see it? Actually, no, it's more of a purple ish look to it. Now, first impression, let me just give it to you guys. The leather quality is not that bad. It's all tumbled. So I actually do dig that. That's actually pretty nice. Um, but you know what? When I saw pictures and when I glanced at them, I really thought just the way how because it has that different type of wing logo here, it has a silver uh, swoosh on here. I thought these the material on this part here, which is actually all tumbled, I thought it was gonna be new buck. Like these were basically gonna look exactly like how the Navy Japans were. This one here, see, has the exact same 
same color like scheme they got going on you know except for one's bordeaux one's navy of course and you know obviously you got the different tongue because this is the more the japanese but it's pretty freaking close and this new buck here you guys see it you know like that and it has a little bit of that tumbled that's how i thought these were going to be now now is this colorway i'm really nervous because the way how this colorway is i've had color color uh, shoes with this colorway and like for some reason this colorway always bleeds hopefully that's not the case with these it just kind of looks more ink to it i think i would have liked this better if it wasn't all leather i think i would have liked this better if it was new buck just because of this colorway literally thought it was gonna be pretty close to this and this is fire this is the fire freaking shoe um with this whole navy and everything clean colorway same with this it's a clean colorway got your extra laces here um this is my size too these are set to come out this weekend so it should be on the flex app I don't know what finish line and all that is doing. Usually they do like exclusive access. They might be doing in-store raffles or something. I wanna call your local finish line if they are gonna get these things. Man, I'm trying to, you know what, man? I'm gonna just wait on my review. Like the materials and everything, I'm actually really digging it. Like I'm, I'm, I'm actually, you know what? I, I kinda like these things, man. These are not that bad. These are actually one of probably, maybe because we've been having such trash Air Jordan 1s that like, this now that we got this colorway like hey man this is better than those this is definitely better than those not that bad of a shoe it's really not this is actually a really good looking shoe you know it's it's actually pretty clean there's definitely no hype on these things man i haven't heard anyone talk about these things i'm not hearing anyone's like saying oh they gotta have these or people make a whole bunch of uh you know ig posts or blog posts or anything like that like there's not many there's not much hype on these things at all like people are really sleeping on these things like I'm really surprised. Last year in 2020, once you know when we're still locked down and you know, you know Air Jordan One's hype was still up the roof. Yeah, these things could have been a major problem. But since it's like now this year, you know the sneaker market right now, the sneaker game is not what it used to be, guys. You know, like no one's getting that free money anymore. Um, you know, colorways are just kind of dying out. Some we're getting some really bad colorways here and there. And not only that, it's just like. We haven't really got that great of a release yet that people are really psyched about. So reselling these things are not that bad. The reselling these things looking even pre-sales right now is less than 300, less than 250. These things are probably gonna be, they might just fall in the same category like some of the other Air Jordan ones. You know? Might even hit less than like pretty close to retail. I wouldn't be surprised if these things hit less than 220. Man, man, it's not that bad of a shoe. It's actually really freaking nice. It's clean. Uh, that's what I like about it. It's a clean colorway. Maybe some people don't like that metallic swoosh or something, or that that little um, hologram bubble Air Jordan 1 wing logo. I'm sure some people are probably not feeling that, but you know, to me, it doesn't really bother me too much. It's, it's a different, you know, perspective on it, but you know, it's I. Yeah, it's the same wing logo like how it is on these Japans, exact same. So, I don't know, man. You guys let me know what you guys think about these things. I think they're okay. I like the materials. I like how it's all tumbled. It's actually, that's pretty nice. That's pretty good. You know, I've always been complaining about Air Jordan ones. We haven't got all anything tumbled and stuff like that. So finally we got a freaking Air Jordan one that's all tumbled. Of course, maybe some people's not feeling this colorway, but I think it's clean. You know, you know what it, it probably is guys. I just, I just think that the hype on Air Jordan ones right now, it's kind of fizzled out. Like it's not what it used to be, you know, obviously, yes, I believe these things are going to sell out. Yes, that's just given. You know, it's Air Jordan 1. It's probably not going to be that much stock out there, especially locally. So, yeah, these things are probably going to sell out probably instantly. Even brick, you know, that's a lot of Air Jordan 1's been bricking a lot lately. You know, I think the last Air Jordan 1's we got was a prototype. Boy, I was not feeling those, though. I'm actually, I'm, you know what? These, I, I'm not going to lie. I'm actually feeling these. These are not that bad. I'm not hyping it up like it's the best Air Jordan 1, so don't put down in the comments. Like, later on, try to, like, oh, didn't you say the Bordeaux's were fire i said they're cool they're nice they i you know i actually might keep want to keep one in my collection i'm not gonna lie i might actually want to keep one in my collection for where would i rank these things in air jordan ones like top 10 air jordan ones of 2021 i mean i can think like off top of my head at least six probably air jordan ones better that came out so far this year better than these but it's up there it's probably one one of the better colorways that we've been getting i mean you guys tell me uh like i'll put these in the same category as these like just a clean colorway it's cool and all but at the same time i'm just kind of like not all that i'm not really hyped about it i'm i'm going i'm not gonna sleep on these things you know what 
Uh, I am going to go down to Orlando this weekend. I'm supposed to uh, see my boy Joe's in wedding. I'm going to bring the whole family. We're going to go down to Orlando, spend the whole trip of it. And you know what? I'm going to try to get these things. And if I can't get them, anyone in Orlando, if you guys have a pair, hit me up. Size 9, 9.5. I need these things, okay? Matter of fact, I need a 9.5, guys. I need a 9.5. Uh, usually every time I go to Orlando, I always take L's anyway, especially on the flex out because majority of everyone in freaking Florida is all, are all resellers. No, no. I've been in Florida so many times this year. I know how the culture is in Florida. So, hey, shout out to everyone in Florida. It's like my second home, literally. I've been back to, I've been going to Florida at least once or twice a month <laughs> to going back to Florida. Like, I've been in Florida so many times. It's like, I'm about to get a condo. I really am. Or I'm about to move down to Florida. Like, seriously. Like, yeah, man, these are cool, man. These are actually pretty nice. I'm just really surprised that people are actually pretty much sleeping on these things i don't know we'll see what happens on this weekend uh, during uh when these things uh drop will these things sell out people are gonna go crazy over these things or people just not gonna care you know I, I have a feeling that it's probably gonna be one of those like people's probably not gonna really care if people get w's they're probably like cool if they don't then they're gonna be like move on you know it's like one of those things it's just a crazy time like how like things change from one year to one year like so bad you know what i mean like <laughs> Air Jordan 1s was like it for a good five years. Last year, Air Jordan 1s was so hyped up. Everyone loved Air Jordan 1s no matter what colorway it was. Like I wasn't feeling the biohacks, but there were some people that was loving those things. Hey, everyone has their own opinions, okay? Don't kill me because of my opinion. I make these video, I just always try to make these videos 100% authentic and I give you guys my full 100% opinion, you know? That's what I try to make these videos about. But anyway guys, I appreciate y'all. I'll see you guys soon, Orlando. Uh, like I said, no event or anything. Just gonna go down to my boy Joe's uh, wedding. Just gotta support my guy. Gonna bring the family. You know, gonna make a trip of it and everything. Gonna go down Disney and all that good stuff. So, yeah, I can't wait. I'm finally gonna get a vacation. Like an actual vacation, you know? I deserve it. I deserve a vacation. I haven't had a, an actual vacation over two years now. It's, if you wanna call these trips and all that, I don't call them vacation. It's still work at the end of the day. It's fun work, but still work. Anyway, guys, I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. If you guys don't mind, please hit that thumbs up. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Comment down below and please hit that bell for all the notifications when I do drop vids. And don't forget to follow me on all my social media at German Chris on IG, sometimes I'm on Twitter, and don't forget Snapchat. Anyway, guys, appreciate y'all. Love y'all. I'm Jumpman Chris. Peace.